Hello again everybody, Mental Fox here. Thanks for joining me again on my Let's Play of The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. We're continuing our roaming of the countryside, checking out undiscovered locations, such as this one right here, undiscovered location. We're getting ready to head over to this one. At the end of the last episode, we made it over here, uh, but then ended up dying to like the leader of these guys. And uh, luckily the game had saved for us right here when we fast traveled to this Ford location. Uh, so we're going to rush in here and try it again. Hopefully not get our butts kicked this time. Um, I just meditated, so I've got three of three swallow potions. I might even try using Thunderbolt. And, uh, hell, maybe I might even throw a bomb at them. I don't know. Let us call our good steed Roach. Roach can make his way through the woods there. Come on over here, Roach. You can do it now. Come on. There we go. Let's hop on Roach. Hey right over here. Hey ya. So yeah, there's um quite a party up here. Let's see if I can remember how to get up here. Huh? Whoa there, Roach. Not sure I remember how to get up to this place. Um, was it here? I think it was here where I climbed up. Yeah, right here. So we'll climb up here. And over here. This is a pretty well defended area they've got, I must say. And... Let's see, these guys are going to be to my right. Uh, what sign do I have available? I've got Igni. I was using Quen. We'll stick with Quen. There we go. Let's get this party started. Oh, he's going to try to hit me with a arrow. Oh, there's the uh, leader guy. I want to stay away from him. I really don't want to fight right here on this ledge, though. Oh. Okay, let's back it up a little bit. Uh, dude, move, move. What, what? Trees in my way or something. All right, I'm gonna try to put some space between me and them. I really... Oh, what? Somebody hit me, I don't know who. Oh, okay, we got him. And now I think just the deserter leader is left, maybe. He is pretty tough. Um, I don't know what happened if I tried Thunderbolt. I don't really know for sure what that does. Look at this guy. How do you like that? Oh, I killed him! <laughs> One bomb and he's dead. <laughs> yeah! Okay. Cool. Uh, Alright, where's the dead bodies? I want to loot. Here we go. Oil and a rusty sword. Uh, there's another dead body right over here. Oh, well, some burger cane fruit also. Loot. Leather straps. Okay. What else we got over here? There's another body right here. Bread and a small blackjack. Alright, well, I'll take the bread. It's good. Not sure where, what that Thunderbolt potion does. Got uh, Thunderbolt increases attack power. Oh, okay. I wonder if that also increases my, like uh, my bomb damage. I don't know. But uh, yeah, that one bomb took care of that guy. So that was pretty cool. And luckily, it didn't hurt me. I was a little worried that I was too close to him and I was going to end up hurting myself. But it didn't happen. Whoops. <laughs> I meant to press one button, but instead pressed the other. What the hell? There we go. Uh, so this here, according to our map, is a bandit camp. A group of dangerous bandits has made camp here. Well, now they're dead. And now everything that was theirs is now mine. I like that happy ending to that story. Let's pick this here if I can. What is this? Sometimes it's a little tedious. There we go. Some Bryonia. Hmm. I haven't seen that before. Huh. Is there more of that down here? Because it's kind of interesting. Bryonia. Alright. 
Alright, let's go over here and see what these guys were guarding. Oh, up here. Some goodies up here. Whoops. Oh, uh, well, there's a letter here. There's a bunch of boxes. Let's pick this up. Scrawled notes. Let's take a look at that. Uh, items. Angrily scrawled notes. That's what we just picked up. Let's read that. What am I supposed to fucking die for? Tamaria? Da died for that. So did my three brothers, and what did that get them? Fuck all, that's what. Not even a decent burial. Da always said, a wise man learns from others' mistakes. So here I am, learning from his. And instead of dying for Tamaria, I'm going to rob those who killed Tamaria's sons. We've pitched a camp, got us a great spot, middle of the woods, near that old mill. Now we're all set to go out on our first raid. Okay. Good to know. Let's uh, get to looting this other stuff. We've got a vial. Orins. Isn't this a box I could loot? Oh, I didn't want to ignite that. Eh, whatever. Um. Oh, okay. That box I can't loot. Let's loot this crap over here. Phosphorus. Phosphorus. Old sheepskin. Cotton. What else we got over here? Anything? Over here. Interrogation report and a diagram for a serpentine steel sword, which we actually already have. We're using it right now. Interrogation reports. New crafting diagram. I already have that. It's quest updated scavenger hunt viper school gear. Oh, quest completed viper school gear. Well, if you say so. <clears throat> completed. Where is it? Viper School Gear. Wow, it's a suggested level 6, and somehow I made that without even knowing it. While traveling the downtrodden lands of Velen and the former Temerian border regions, Geralt found clues about the location of a set of diagrams for crafting the legendary equipment once worn by the Viper School of Witchers. Motivated by curiosity and the prospect of acquiring these priceless objects, he decided to pursue, pursue this lead. After a short investigation, Geralt managed to acquire diagrams for every element of the Viper School's famous equipment. He also learned the tragic story of Colgrim, a fellow Witcher who died while trying to escape after being unjustly incarcerated for kidnapping a beekeeper's son. And actually, now that I think about it, um, let's see here. Look in crafting. I um, have the Serpentine Silver Sword. And we just picked up the diagram for the steel sword. Uh, 49. That does more damage than the one I've got now. So if I had some emerald dust, I don't know where to find that. But if I had some of that, we could craft this. Huh, emerald dust. Apparently I had some when I made the serpentine silver sword. Emerald dust. Huh. Okay, well, maybe, maybe if we ever find some emerald dust, we'll craft that. But for the time being, we don't have it. So, anything else around here we could loot? Yeah, it's pretty neat that we just completed that quest without even realizing it. Okay, well, that's all there is to this place. So now let's look at our map again. And there is something down here. And if I remember correctly, uh, this is where there are some... Um, Drowners. Uh, I haven't been here yet. We could just go straight ahead there and see what there is to see. Whoa, I did not mean to jump. There's a way you can easily go down here without hurting yourself, but I don't remember what it is. Yeah, I don't... There's a button you could press that'll make you climb down off of something without jumping off of it, but I don't remember what it is. Hmm, where am I? Uh, I'm not exactly going in the direction I thought I was going to go in. So in that case, maybe since we're already down here, let's run over here and see if we can't take care of these drowners. I'm a little concerned about it, because last time I tried to fight them, I got my butt kicked. Hmm, here's a package here. Let's help ourselves. Uh, let's save the game, so in case I die, I won't have to do this all over again. Let us draw our silver sword. And um, 
You know, one thing I know about uh, drowners is that they don't like Igni. Oh, nope, too far away. Alright, let's let my Igni rejuvenate here, and we'll run up here. This is an Igni. Oh, I guess it is, okay. Hey, drowner. Calm down, drowner. Really didn't do as much damage as I hoped it would do. Let's roll over here. And we'll go ahead and crash it. Cra cast Igni at him again. He doesn't like that. There we go. That's how you take care of drowners. I highly recommend Igni. Alright. Let's see here. We've got um, a drowner brain. Uh, elemental essence. Ooh, yuck, look at him. Ugh. Drowner tongue and drowner brain. Did we get what we came here for? Oh, these aren't even the drowners we're interested in. Another item here. Deer hide. Yeah, we're interested in those drowners down there. Do you see them way down there? So let's run down here. Take these guys out. New marker guarded treasure. So these guys are guarding a treasure. Three of them here? Hmm. see what happens if I do this. Can I throw it this far? Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Well. Killed some of them. Okay, he's dead. Cool. Okay, awesome. Whoa, look at these boards just hanging in the in the air like that. Neat. Huh. Drown her tongue. Drown her tongue and drown her brain. Oh, this guy doesn't have anything for me? Nothing from you, really? That's disappointing. Let's go take a look at this treasure. Oh, this is the treasure they were guarding. Let's go ahead and pick up his monster bone and drowner brain. Monster bone. Alright. Uh, Skellige Gambeson. That's an armor. String, wolf's leather. Uh, diagram for exploding bolt. A torn out page with water hag decoction. Okay. Which might be interesting. Look at a lot of cool stuff in this game. New alchemy formula. Hmm, okay. And here we've got orange, alchemist powder, linen, Tamarian poniard diagram, and tawny owl manuscript page. Cool. Still haven't found what I'm looking for though, but uh, the fact that we're finding. Uh, diagram pages for other potions gives me hope that we may find the diagram page for uh, hybrid oil, which is uh, really what I'm looking for. Let's take a look at our map here. Um, okay, there's nothing further this way. So, I guess we'll just run along the coast here, and then we'll go to this location here. Let's go ahead and save things. I wonder if a horse can come down here. Hey, there's Roach. Nicely done, Roach. Alright, let's go for a little run on the beach here. Let's see, we go up this way. I think. I don't know, maybe this was a mistake. It's kind of looking like a mistake. Let's just go back to the beach. We'll run up the beach. Whoops, I accidentally took my Swallow Potion. That's just great. Oh well, whatever. Hmm. Can you swim? No. <laughs> I don't know what happened to Roach. Roach just kind of disappeared there. Alright, how do I get out of here? Hmm. This is kind of annoying. Huh. Great. Can I get through here? No? I can't get through there. Alright. Doesn't have to punch it. Oh, crap. Whoa, that was quite a jump there, Geralt. Um, can you complete it by climbing up there? Come on, Geralt. Get up there. Come on, man. Don't make me go all the way around. Ah, Geralt. How the hell am I supposed to get up here? Whoops. Come on, dude. 
Sheesh. Really? I can use a portal about now. I can use a portal about now? I just want to get out of this... Ah, oh, jeez. Um, it put me over here. Man, I'm still in the water. How the hell do I get out of here? Jeez. This is annoying. I'm annoyed. Okay, swim, Geralt. Don't try to walk across the bottom of the water there. I guess I'll have to go up this way. Because I can't figure out how to get off of this riverbed. Ooh, something to loot here. Long rube? Alright. Oh, here's some other stuff. Uh, empty bottle and uh, white wolf hide. Hmm. Alright, let's run up through here. Ooh, something else here. Gosh, there's all kinds of stuff around here. Oh my gosh. Crowns and orins. Oh, come on. How do I get out of here? I want to go this way, damn it. Uh, I guess I can't climb up there. Wow, this is annoying. Can I go up here? Alright. Oh, that peasant appeared out of nowhere. Oh, he doesn't... Oh my, what happened here? What the hell? Can I talk to him? Oh my. Huh. Well, let's go and see if we can steal some stuff from him. Hello, little girl. You don't mind if I just help myself to whatever's in this chest over here, do you? Linen, dimaterium plate, and orins. Okay. Hi, little girl. Go! Go? Oh no. Go! Oh. Yawn, alright. <sighs> alright, how the heck am I gonna get to where I wanna go? This is uh, kinda getting on my nerves here a little bit. There's a crossroads around here somewhere, right? Oh, he's crying too. These people are not happy. Where's this crossroads? Or not crossroads, but uh, road sign. So we'll go over to the road sign here, and uh, we will fast travel to here, and then just go south to there. Since I couldn't figure out how to get over there from my current location. So now we're here at the Ford, and we'll just go south to uh, this location here and see what the heck this is. So we'll call Rusty and run down there. Rusty, I keep calling him Rusty. <laughs> I've named my horse Rusty. His name is no longer Roach. All right, let's see what awaits us down Come here. On. Okay, let's slow down here. We don't want to run up on something unprepared. Uh, let's get Quinn ready. Because this is probably going to be a camp. Yeah, it's camp. Oh, they already see me. This guy's already shooting arrows at me. Alright, who wants to come out here and face me first? There's the leader. Oh! What the hell? Stupid bow guy. Oh, oh gosh. Oh. oh man, I don't have any bombs. Let's um do a thunderbolt. Do all of these guys have bows? What? Okay, let's back it up. Cast Quinn again. Oh hello, come on Quinn. To wait for it to get my stamina back. Oh, he's just gonna stand. Oh, I one hit him. Cool. Nice. Oh, you son of a. Come on, let's get this. Come on. Okay, he's dead. What is hitting me? Better take a swallow. He's dead. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Ooh, ooh! <laughs> nice. Okay, took care of those guys. I didn't really like how much damage they did to me, though. Sheesh. Let's see what stuff they've got. Uh, cured leather in a small backpack. Not too exciting. Oh, I want that floating bow. That's pretty cool. Here we've got uh, grilled chicken sandwiches, small backpack. A uh, silk and a sword. Razor and a sword. And this guy. Cotton. All right. I might as well pick up this Celandine while we're here. See what these guys were guarding. Got a chest here. Hunting gauntlets, alchemist powder, dog tallow, manuscript page for Dragon's Dream, and crowns. Uh, lunar shards. Meteorite ore. Well, these guys are into space rocks. And... Uh, oh, let's line ourselves up perfectly. Uh, meteorite ore. Okay. Anything else here? Doesn't look like it. 